for me, this is one of the reasons I love being a chaplain, is multiple denominations, multiple people all coming together. It's amazing, this installation. And so when we talk about that, just the support that we get from the commands to do exactly what we're supposed to be doing by law, which believe it or not, this is the neat thing about being a chaplain, by law, we're supposed to conduct a service for our unit on Sundays. And so what a joy to be able to do it on a post that doesn't have a chapel. And so this is really the one service we do throughout the year. And it's really neat. And so we have the various commands come together to celebrate a tremendous, tremendous event in history that changed history. That was amazing. Uh, so we're uh, just glad to have the support and, um, and we hope that everything that was presented today was encouraging and, and uplifting and, and uh, fill hearts with hope and gladness and joy and the support that we received from uh, the entire First Army, our commander came here. Uh, we, we used every single chair. So our, our message that we want everyone to, uh, to realize is that your, your faith matters and your spiritual resiliency is important. to think about that for a second. I don't know the last ruck march you were on, but how much weight did you have on your back? So here at First Army, in the chaplain section, we believe in spiritual, emotional, mental, and physical fitness. And we believe that spiritual fitness is the most important of all those because it creates the foundation for the rest of them to rest on. And so it is through our spiritual fitness that we become fit in every uh, possible way. The sunrise service, and this is what's so exciting, when you look out across this area, you get to see such tremendous symbolism, which we kind of brought up at the end as well, which is out of the darkness comes light. 